Today I will discuss about Hirschberg corneal reflex test. Hirschberg test is an objective test performed with a simple pen torch and gives rough objective estimation of angle of a manifest squint. It uses first Purkinje image to assess alignment of eyes or potential strabismus. Being an objective test, it can be used in young and uncooperative patients or when fixation in deviating eye is poor. The Hirschberg test is also known as the corneal light reflex test because in this test we assess the reflex of point light source in patient's eyes. Procedure of the test Patient sits at a distance of 50 cm from the examiner. Examiner turn on the pen light and direct it towards the midline of the nose, that is middle of the eyes. Then instruct the patient to look at the light. Now examiner placing his eyes directly behind the pen light. Observe the corneal light reflex from the both eyes. The degree of strabismus can be roughly estimated by measuring the decentration of the reflex from the center of pupil in millimeters. 1 mm of the deviation of the reflex is equal to 15 prism diopter. Remember these points. 1 degree is equal to 2 prism diopters and 1 mm is equal to 7 degrees or 14 prism diopters. Now documentation. Observation. A reflection is center in each pupil. Interpretation. Ortho position or normal alignment. Observation Reflection is decentered temporarily from the center of pupil. Interpretation Isotropia Observation Reflection is decentered nasally from the center of pupil. Interpretation Exotropia Observation Reflection is decentered downward from the center of pupil. Interpretation Hypertropia Observation Reflection is decentered upward from the center of pupil. Interpretation Hypotropia Always remember the corneal reflex is decentered opposite to the deviation of eyes. If the eyes move in or izu, the reflex will go out. If the eyes moves out or exu, then the reflex will move in. Now estimation of deviation by Hirschberg corneal reflex test. Accuracy is less because this is an objective test and we are not using any prism to measure the deviation. But it's quite good for rough estimation of deviation. If the reflex is in between the center of pupil and pupillary margin, rough estimation of deviation is 7 degree or 15 prism diopter. If the reflex is at pupillary margin, the rough estimation of deviation is 15 degree or 30 prism diopter. If the reflex is in between the pupillary margin and limbus then the rough estimation of deviation is 30 degree or 60 prism diopters. If the reflex is at limbus, rough estimation of deviation is 45 degree or 90 prism diopters. If the reflex is at sclera, more than 45 degree or more than 90 prism diopters.
Stay with Smart Optometry and study optometry smartly.